I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw different types of vegetables. And up here in the corner, I'm going to write vegetables so I don't forget what I'm drawing. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to draw my tic-tac-toe grid, which is two straight lines going down and two straight lines going across. I'm going to start over here on the upper left corner, and I'm going to put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, leave it floating. Right next to it, I'm putting another dot, and I'm going to draw a straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, and leave it floating. I go back to the first space, and I'm going to draw one curved line, two curved lines. Come on the next one, one curved line, two curved lines. Come back to the first space and we're just going to draw some little straight lines going down. Come back to the second one, same thing. I come up to the top on this first one and I just draw a straight diagonal up, straight diagonal down, zigzag, zigzag, connect. Come right where I started, straight diagonal up, straight diagonal down, zigzag, zigzag, connect. Now we're going to jump over on this one. Straight diagonal up, straight diagonal down, bam, it crashes into that. Jump over and just go zigzag, zigzag. Now we start right here, straight diagonal out, straight diagonal down, zigzag, zigzag, connect. These are carrots. Carrots. Now I come to the middle section. Down here at the bottom I put a dot and I'm just going to draw wavy wavy line, wavy wavy line, wavy wavy line, keep going, wavy wavy line, keep going, wavy wavy line, keep going, wavy line, connect. This is lettuce. Lettuce, okay? Now I come over to this box and I'm just going to draw Slightly curved line, come back to the left, big curved line down, over, leave it floating, come on the right, big curved line down, over, connect. Come inside and go zigzag, 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 zigzag. This is a tomato. Tomato. Okay? Now I come over. To this box and I draw the letter V and I come right down below it and I draw a slightly curved line down on the left, slightly curved line down on the right. Come back to the left and let's just add a slightly curved line. Come up to the left hand side and we're just going to go curve line, curve line, curve line, connect, jump over, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. This is broccoli. Broco broccoli. Okay? I come right here and I put a dot in the middle. And from that dot going towards the left, I draw a curved line down, wavy line. Come back to the dot on the right, curved line down, wavy line, little baby circles. Come down at the bottom, draw a slightly curved line, curved line, curved line up, connect, and this is a mushroom. 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 Okay? Come over here to this box, put a dot. We're going to draw a big curved line up, down, connect. Now we're going to mimic that line, big curved line over connect. Inside we're going to draw baby circles. Baby circles. These are peas. Peas. Okay? Come over here on the bottom. Let's put a dot. 
and we're going to draw a curve line up, down, over, leave it floating, come back to the dot, curve line up, down, over, connect. We're going to draw one, two, three straight lines and come up in the center and we're just going to draw curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line. This is a, let's see where I can fit that, a bell pepper. Bell pepper. Okay? Next box. Put a dot at the top. Big curve line down. Up. Connect. At the very tippy top. Zigzag, zigzag. Now we're going to mimic these lines up. Up. And connect. And now we're going to draw slightly curved lines inside. And now we're going to draw little straight lines going across. And down at the bottom we'll just draw one, two, three little curved lines. This is corn. Okay? Now, last box. Slightly wavy line. Connect. Slightly wavy line. Connect. Dot, 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 dot. These are potatoes. Potatoes. Okay? Let's see how we are going to color these in. Okay, I'm going to start with my regular green, and I'm going to color this space. And this space. regular green. Then I'm going to take my yellow green and I'm just going to retrace my lines on this space. And then I come in with my regular green and loop-de-loop -loop lightly over the yellow green. Okay. Then I come over here to my zigzags and I color these in green, regular green. And I come over here to this space and I color this in regular green. You know, vegetables or plants, lots of green. Jump over, come over here, color this in green. And I'm going to add a couple of green lines and I'm going to add a little bit of my yellow green and then my regular green I'm going to come back in and do the baby circles and I'm going to add a little bit of yellow green on the inside okay then I come down to this space and this is all green so I'm going to color this in regular green This outside part is green. Lots of green on this one. I think that's it. Now, I come in with my brown and I color this little space up here. I'm going to color my little baby circles brown and then I'm going to lightly color this space. And I'm going to come down to this space and color these lightly brown. Okay? If you lose your dots, you're coloring too dark. Okay. Next, take my yellow, color in this space right here. Use my yellow green, color in the space on the outside. Now I'm going to take my orange, color in this space here, and this space here. Take my red, color this space here. Okay. Now, 
just to give a little bit more detail. I'm going to take my black and I'm just going to put some little curved lines on this space. And I think I'm going to put a couple of little black lines on this space. Not too much. Okay, oops, I forgot. A couple of little black lines on my potatoes. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here are my vegetables all colored in. Okay, bye-bye.